class is in session. The professor is in. We are live on the Twitch. We're going to be live on the YouTube. That's exactly it, right? <laughs> you tell them, LC Blue. So we are here for the Roman Reigns Rock and Reigns Prize Wall. We are going to do the uh, prize wall video here live on the Twitches. Big shout out, of course, as always, to Jay Nasty Booty. And then on top of that, this always depends on your roster, what you have and what you can get. So keep that in mind as we go through everything. So everything I give you here is just a suggestion, but it always depends on what's on your roster to make your roster better immediately. So that way you can get more resources down the line, right? Something that's going to help you right now. So first and foremost, best thing on here usually is the plate on a showdown weekend that comes out, right? So the shades of rains, uh, whenever you make seven or more cross break gems, you're going to increase the gem damage and move damage by a hundred percent, all your gems, all your moves. So obviously this is going to be good on the Roman reigns that we have for this weekend. There's lots of other characters that it's going to be really great on. Can't wait to get it and can't wait to try it out on a lot of people. So if you have some ideas, put it into, uh, into the comments after this video of anybody that you want to see this on anybody making those cross break gems, but that's, the biggest thing on here is usually get the plate that comes out on the weekend itself. So it's going to be very good on a lot of people. The next best thing on here actually probably is the other plates as well. And they're all awesome for different reasons. Obviously, uh, the lion's gaze, anytime you throw down X break gems or sorry, break X break gems, you're going to deplete your opponent's MP moves. So this works great on obviously zombie Bianca. And this new Roman Reigns. So there's lots of people that can benefit from a lion's gaze. So this is a really good one to get. But if you're going to have 40,000, I would suggest maybe this one first, unless you really need one of those. Um, Hard Times, also really good. Bianca's Braid, also really good. Hard Stopper, also really good. The deal and steal of this prize wall is actually a heroic titan's chest. Uh, crest, sorry, not chest. It could be both. And this is a really good one that a lot of people either don't have or could use on multiple people. So that's another place that I would probably spend this. Two words for you is a good plate, but maybe not something you would get. Maybe with just your leftover medallions is where you'd want to get that. Now, if you do end up getting about 21,000 and not pulling Roman, then you're going to want to pull Roman. And if you haven't seen the videos, go check out Goldie's video. Go check out Zoro's video. You know, go check out Betty's video, Merrick's video. Check out. DJ's video, make sure you go check out everybody else's video. Uh, I wasn't given Roman Reigns for some uh, technical reasons, um, but I wasn't able to actually do a preview video of him. So go check out the other champs and their preview videos. But Roman is really good. You're going to want to get him if you do get enough. Um, <laughs> you check it all. So that's somewhere you would go for it. The next on the list, and this is where it becomes dicey, right? So while it's great to get plates, it's also great to get posters of people as well, too. So if you are close, like Don J, shout out, getting close to maybe Dusty Roads, uh, this is a chance to pick up the shards to get you that poster, right? So that's obviously going to make your roster better. For me, I would go with the newest plate before I went with... Um, a new card, but some of these cards are actually really good. Dusty's really good. Brutus is really good. And then I would put a tier below them. Unless you have all the things, Cody can be really good. Can't, Cody can be lightning in a bottle uh, with the right uh, setup. Part of that right setup that you need for him uh, is a hard times uh, <laughs> plate. So speaking of plates and things, um, but again, for your roster, if plates aren't your thing or if you're not too worried you think you'll get your plate later on down the road and you really want the poster then maybe that's where you could spend uh that right there um if you already have roman i'm not sure you would spend for the strap here but if you didn't get good straps already and you have roman and you got them from his opening to, uh, tour then here's maybe a place where you could spend that uh currency is maybe get try your luck it's expensive and for that price you could actually get yourself three really good plates in the hard times, the braid or the heart stopper. So I would think twice about spending uh, on that. After that point, it's basically econ at that point, right? So after that, um, if you want to try for straps and these ones, as always, um, are going to be any number, mostly 30% move defense or 40% gem damage. That's what you most likely will get. That's where the odds are. And then it's also any one of these classes. So you're taking a chance <laughs> with what you're getting there. 
But after that, it is basically econ and what you need. If you do need powerhouse tokens and TP, then that's what you should get. If you want to try a, a, a lower variety of that, if you need more coins, that's what you should get at this point. I always recommend against grabbing the Star Fragments case because you're likely to get just 20 and not 400 from whichever one you get out of that. Save that 500, spend it somewhere else. And the last thing you should get on this list is only if you really want to waste your, your currency is the six star bronze Roman reigns. Nobody should be getting this. Everybody should be getting plates, posters, or other things on this prize wall. All right. Let me know in the comments what you get from this prize wall. Let me know how you did this weekend. As always, give this video the like, the share, the subscribe, help the bro out, and I will see you the next time we have class. Bro-fessor out.